Welcome to Penn Engineering Graduate Admissions Virtual Tour. My name is Connor Gallegos, one of the Enrollment Specialists here at Penn. Today we're going to take a look at some of the buildings and labs that you can expect to see as a student here at the University. Come along. This is the Office of Academic Services. During the academic terms, students have the opportunity to attend advising hours at the Office of Academic Services. These sessions are available for various purposes, including general inquiries, addressing wellness concerns, seeking clarification on policies, and getting assistance with navigating Penn's offices or finding the right contacts to answer your questions. The Office of Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion is located on the second floor of the town building. The Office of Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion within Penn Engineering is deeply dedicated to the goal of enrolling, nurturing, and graduating engineers who mirror the diversity of our broader society in every aspect. Welcome to Penn Engineering. The General Robotics Automation, Sensing, and Perception, or GRASS Laboratory, is a research facility within SEAS. The GRASS Laboratory spans several lab spaces in Levine and Town buildings on the Engineering School's east end of Penn's campus. The main GRASS lab is located at Levine Hall, room 403. Its mission is the creation and integration of knowledge through scholarly research, entrepreneurship, and innovation. The lab aims to design and deliver robotics education and training for students to become leaders in robotics. It also prioritizes research to advance our fundamental understanding of robots and intelligent systems and technology development to be a catalyst for innovation and entrepreneurship in robotics. The GRASP lab is able to provide both space for experiments and significant computing power for modeling and testing, as well as electrical and mechanical manufacturing and prototyping machinery. The Graduate Student Center serves as a central hub offering resources, activities, support, and advocacy for all graduate and professional students at the University of Pennsylvania. It is conveniently located at 3615 Locust Walk, providing a central space for relaxation, lunch, and networking with fellow graduate and professional students from various departments across the university. In addition to being a central gathering and study spot, the Grad Center hosts numerous events throughout the year. These events are specifically designed to equip students with the skills, experiences, and sense of community necessary for a successful graduate journey. The center also offers a wider range of services and resources to empower graduate and professional students. The Singh Center represents a cutting edge nanotechnology facility that combines traditional approaches to nanoscale development with state-of-the-art equipment, materials, and innovative concepts. The Singh Center promotes the exchange of scientific ideas and the advancement of nanoscale science and technology. It brings together various interdisciplinary capabilities and the necessary staffing to support these advanced tools, thereby establishing a state-of-the-art regional nanotechnology center. Pennovation is a business incubator and laboratory designed to harmonize and unite researchers, innovators, and entrepreneurs. It establishes an environment that encourages collaboration, creativity, and productivity among individuals from diverse disciplines. The Pennovation Center's primary goal is to bring people together, facilitating interaction in the exchange of ideas. The ongoing transformation of Penn's campus includes the construction of cutting-edge research facilities such as Amy Gutman Hall and the Vigelos Institute for Energy Science and Technology, along with several other new facilities and strategic investments. Amy Gutman Hall, a recent addition to Penn, is currently in the construction phase. This state-of-the-art facility will feature next-generation hybrid classrooms and laboratories specifically designed to support research in areas such as graphics and perceptions, privacy and security, computational social science, data-driven medical diagnostics, 
scientific computing, and machine learning. Additionally, it will provide a platform for the development of safe and reliable artificial intelligence. Thanks for coming along our virtual tour. We hope you had a great time and enjoyed seeing some of the buildings that you'd see as a Penn Engineering graduate student. Thank you.